Hello, hello, hello. Ali, Jeff, all eights here. Call me whatever. I hope everyone's having a good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Back again, back again. Let's do this. The rain doesn't seem to be letting up this morning. Yo! GA, how are you after everything? Hey, hey, you told me that she'll be able to come to school again in, a two, in two days. Nice. Oh man, I'm glad. I'm so happy. Thanks to you, Chia. You can thank me for that. <laughs> so, that's, uh, that's some ego on me. That's a uh, thanks to you, Chia. Let's be nice. Come on. You know, it's because all three of us did our best. Actually, more like the three of us. And one animal thingy. Oh, you mean Teddy. <laughs> Words... Uh, Chie and the others. I don't see them. Spring, it's spring, isn't it? My first thought was, this is horrible. I'm stuck with King Morong, that's my home loan teacher. But now, my spring, it isn't over yet. Can I ask you to do something for me? Yeah, what is it? Listen to his request. Alright, well, what I want you to do is... Do you know that girl from our class who always goes up to the roof? I want you to go to see what she's up to. No, th th that's not what I meant. I uh, just wonder what she does up there. That's all. I'm just asking you about it. Uh, sure. That's kind of weird that so you're so curious about what she does. Let's go up to the roof and check out what she's up to. Not ah, because I'm a creep. I'm just gonna be a meteorologist when I'm older. I'm always right. Is that her? Is that the one you were talking about, Mr. Stalker guy? Who's this? Oh, that's Yumi, right? Yep, that's Yumi. Uh, is this my classroom? No, that's... This is my classroom. Uh... Okay, that's not her. I guess I'll have to go up there when it's not raining, because right now, I can't. Who would want to go hang out in the roof? Unless you're that meteorologist girl who wants to check out the weather all the time, then yeah, no one wants to go up to that roof. Achoo! Fusion Ha! A little teardrop persona. I am Saki Mitama. I have come to you, whose heart desires power. Welcome to the party, Saki. Oh yeah, let me see if I can upgrade my stuff, my equipment. My arsenal. Buy weapons, Rai, imitation, I still the same thing. What about over here? No, not there. What was my other job? I think my other job is... Got my other job. Oh yeah, it's the one where I make like origami shit in my room, in my desk, on my desk. Yeah. So yeah, I... let's just forget about that. Currently have... Oh, that's a lot of money. The sign reads, rainy day challenge, 3,000 yen. If you finish this quintuple size bowl, it's free. You feel taking on this sign will help to raise several characteristics. Yeah, let's go. It's the same thing as the burger from Persona 5. So, yeah, let's go for it. Raise up your strength. You begin to suspect that your bowl is a portal to another meat dimension. The amount of meat contained within this bowl is truly staggering. In order to finish this bowl, you must first have an understanding of your limits and knowledge to control your pace, courage to face this relenting tide of beef, and the diligence to preserve preserve against persevere against this colossal challenge. <laughs> okay. All these traits are necessary to master the rainy day special mega beef bowl challenge. You are unable to finish your meal in your current state. So I just wasted 3,000. At least do I like get a boost in one of my abilities understanding has increased okay yeah it increases a lot nice ah yeah too bad sir that'll be 3000 yen come back soon thank you yeah i'll finish it someday trust me i'll beat your challenge i believe it i believe it welcome 
Like Naruto always says, believe it. Nanako, it's raining. Yes, it's obvious. You can ask Nanako permission for the forecast. Tomorrow is no. Tomorrow is still gonna be raining, but on Saturday it's gonna be sunny. Side up. Before we go to bed, let's do the job thing. Let's earn some extra cash because we wasted a lot of money on that beef, chal the beef challenge thing. You want to study? No, I was hoping I could work table. There we go. Make envelopes. We decide to work on making envelopes. Quietly uh, continue the dull task. Your diligence has increased. You're getting distracted intensely. Try to con concentrate intensely. Don't procrastinate. The distractions have overcome your work ethic. You are unable to achieve your goal. <laughs> uh, how relatable. Just like me. Just like me. It's weekend! Rain doesn't seem to be letting up. Today is show a day, so you have a day off from school. All you all you can do is wait for your cocoa's recovery. What would you do today? Yeah, what should I do today? Uh, check. Your room, futon. Wait, am I sleep sleeping on the ground? What? That's dirty. Are you going out? I can watch the house. You watch your Power Rangers? I forgot the Japanese name of the Power Rangers in Japan. Sentai Senpai? Something. I don't know. Anyway, if you leave, you can have to turn here until the evening. Yeah, I'm out of here. It's still raining. Go to town, go to town. And then... Can I hang out with uh, Chie or... What's his name? Uh, the guy... Junpei. No, that's not his name. Yusuke, yeah. Da, da, da. Oh, aren't you the boy who moved into Do Dojima's place? Of course I know all about you. We're neighbors after all. Since you and Anako chan are growing children, I, I worry that Dojima-san doesn't take care of you. Eat your veg veggies, okay? Yes, ma'am. Gather yeah, everyone at the food court? Uh, yeah. I guess. It's pouring! Oh, I can go into the... TV again? No, 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 don't go back home. Don't go back home. Yes. Uh, I haven't talked to that lady yet. So let's talk to her. Return Daikon for one yen. How about it? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? I was hoping I could do something today, like do a job. But I can't seem to do anything. See, this is gonna be a boring episode. I guess. Oh, I went to the school again. It is gonna be a boring episode. Oh, hello there, Mr. Gas Station Attendant. You know that about the midnight channel when it rains in the middle of the night, look into the public television. And wonder of wonders, you'll see your soulmate on in the screen. I don't know if it's true or not, but there seems to be a lot of people who believe it. Maybe I should try it myself. Uh-huh. Uh, I don't know what to do now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I wanna... Let's go here. Manage rescue request. Check on dwellers. Listen to Marguerite's request. This is something that I would like you to ask of you, but it doesn't seem that I would be able to get the answer I desire out of you right now. Okay, I need to raise up my shit. Manage rescue request. Utilize skill cards. Give skill cards. The, uh... Yes. Okay, it's done. I've added skill cards that I, that I can clone to the list. Five skill cards. So that's Dia. Slightly restores one. Allies SP. Nothing, nothing, nothing to do. Oh, wow. It is going to be a boring episode until you could go recover us. So I guess. Yeah, let's wait. Wait it out. Wait it out. Let's also buy some. Hey, what is this? 200 Ren. Play. Oh, it's one of those gotcha games or something. Your prize is stuck. Call the lady in Shiroko? Yes. 
they only work on days when the day weather is nasty, like rain. What? Then it's raining. I remember it rained when he made them. Oops, I'm sorry for such a morbid story. Let me get you, your price and it'll take you a second. Ice cube. Sorry for the wait. This is a token of my apology. Oh, you don't need to. Oh, that's nice of you. It wasn't your fault. That was actually pretty sweet of her. Due to the weekend rainfall, clear skies seem unlikely in the area. A thick fog is expected to set in tonight and remain until tomorrow morning, with heaviest concentration in the Inaba area. Anyone planning to go out tonight should take care. Now for our hourly weather breakdown. More fog, huh? There's been a lot of that lately. Hopefully it's not a sign of more trouble. Uh, uh, uh. What did I say about changing the channel without asking? <laughs> Have a great day, even during Golden Week, at your local Juness. Oh, that's why she changed the channel. <laughs> oh, here we Come go. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Sing along, everyone. Sing Every along. Day is great, great at your Juness. Every day is great at, at your Juness. During Golden Week. <laughs> I heard. Do you want to go somewhere during the long holiday? <laughs> we can go somewhere? How about it? Got any plans yet? Uh, nope, no plans. Oh, that's mean. I'm not interested. I don't want to go with you guys. No, let's be nice. I got no plans. <laughs> Juness, Juness, Juness. <laughs> you sure you want to go to Juness? We can go there anytime. It's only a supermarket. <laughs> Nanako is so eager to go there, even though it's like basically like every other supermarket. Come on, girl. Time for bed. It's late. All right. So excited. Every Right at, at your Juness. Nanako seems very excited about the family outing. Bet she is. I bet she is. Mr. Dojima, what you up to? Juness, huh? She's satisfied to go somewhere else that's so close. Well, I'm not going to force you, but if you don't have any plans, try to keep it in mind. I don't have any plans, but what about you? Are you sure you are not going to cancel the plans because of what's happening lately? Uh -huh. Don't be a shitty father. Be a shitty father now. Uh, let's see. Let's see my status. What can I improve my... Switch info, my knowledge. Aware. Courage is reliable, diligence is cal ca callow, understanding is basic, expression is rough. Okay. Courage looks to be good. Let's try to raise up my knowledge and stuff. Watch TV in your room. Wait, what? Okay. Midnight channel. Tick tock, tick tock. It's midnight. Who shall appear on our TV today? Fog has set in. No one is appearing on the Midnight Channel. Since Yukiko has been rescued, it seems the killer was thwarted this time. Nice. Meanwhile, at the fo fog shrouded shopping district. Dun, 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 dun. My cat is on my desk. No, no, no. I'm trying to play. What was that? That was such a short scene and just some guy walking. What? Hey, Yumi! I mean, Yukiko! How are you today? Oh, nice to see you. Good morning. Why are you so nervous? Feeling better? Yeah. I'll be coming to school again, so... That'll be nice. That will be nice. I caused everyone some real trouble. I'm mm -hmm. sorry. 
No, don't apologize. It's not your fault that you got kidnapped. No. Sorry isn't quite right. What I mean to say is... Thank you. Thank you. Your girl seems more cheerful than before. My mother's back to work already. She is, so... are being really supportive. Mates! And I think things are going even smoother than before. Damn, you rich girl! You got mates? I if I was trying too hard. No, you're not. I may have been too caught up in the idea that I had to do everything myself. Ever since the incident, I feel like I can think about these things more calmly. But... It's still kind of embarrassing. <laughs> She's blessing for what? You guys saw everything. Even the things I didn't want to admit. Don't worry about that. that. That's only one part of you. You've already changed. Everyone's like that. I already said that to Chie, so let's go with this one. I think I said this to uh, Yusuke. You've already changed. Don't worry about it. No, you've already changed. Yeah, this one's better. Really? Yes, you have. Yukiko! And there's your prince, Chie. <laughs> oh, it's Chie. Yep. Well, I'll talk to you later. Wait, I just realized that the girl over there has a bag that is bypass. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this universe, Ad uh, Adidas, alternative. Yukiko has come back as energetic as ever. It's a good thing you were able to save her. Yeah, huh? Nice bypass bag. Early morning, morning. Classes are about to begin. Du, du, du. Hmm, Yukiko san is back. That's good. I'm glad the only cutie in the class was able to return. Wouldn't you guys agree? Okay, you creep. Oops, I mean, all of you are cute. <laughs> no, really. Yo, yo, you're a teacher, man. Chill, chill. Or please don't tell your parents that I said that, will you? I don't want to get in trouble. You're lucky Twitter, Twitter hasn't been invented yet. Twitter hasn't been invented yet, right? I don't know. Er, uh, ahem. Anyway, I have an interesting topic for you today. Close your books and take a look at the handout. Sounds like a good time to pick on the city boy. Raikun! Oh, come on! Why always me? What is the greatest canyon in the solar system? What? Peruby Canyon, Valles Man Marineris, Grand Canyon. I think it's somewhere in Mars. Like, there's a huge ass canyon, a uh, huge ass canyon, and that's really big. So I think it's a Valles Marineris. Gave the answer you think is correct. Wow, you really are from the city. Well, I guess that doesn't have anything to do with it. Haha. <laughs> On Mars is ten times larger than the Grand Canyon. Yep. I'm smart. Hundred IQ, baby. Mars also hosts Olympus Mons, the largest mountain in the solar system. Uh, is, isn't that... <laughs> I don't know why my brain went dead there for a second. Since you got me started on canyons, I'm gonna cover some material on, on their characteristics. You gave the correct answer. Knowledge has increased. Yeah! Morning. What should I do now? Oh, we're on the roof. Sorry to keep you waiting. The soap was yours, right, Chie? Thanks! Oh... That smells so good! These instant noodles are just the thing to help me through club! How much longer do I have to wait on this? <laughs> the hell? It still needs a few minutes. So why are we here? Oh yeah, we were gonna ask Yukiko what happened. Yukiko-san, I hate to bring up stuff you'd rather not think about, but I need to ask you again. Did you recall anything about when you got kidnapped? No. I thought I might remember something if I let it sit for a while, but as time passes, it only gets hazier. I think... the doorbell rang at the entrance, and someone called for me. But when I woke up after that, I was already in the castle. I'm sorry. No need to apologize. But does this mean her visitor is the culprit? I don't know. If it's true, then that's one daring criminal. What kind of killer would ring the doorbell? The police are probably looking for witnesses, but I don't think we can expect much from them. <laughs> huh. 
as if the culprit wore bright yellow clothes at the scene of the crime. I wonder why whoever it is would do stuff like this. We won't know until we confront him ourselves, but we can be sure of one thing. It's no coincidence that people keep ending up in that place. Someone on our side is definitely kidnapping them and throwing them into the TV. It's murder, all right. Oh yeah, we never told you. This guy and me are gonna catch the culprit ourselves. The police are out of their league on this case, but we got personas. Never fear, we'll get him. Could you lend us a hand? Yeah. Could you lend us a hand? You got your persona also. Huh? Um... I'm helping out too! I can't believe someone would throw people into a place like that. I'm gonna sock whoever's doing this! Chie. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> Let me help too. I want to know why this is happening. Especially if someone hates me so much they want to kill me. I don't want to run away from myself anymore. I don't think it, their motive is because they hate you. I think it's more of, uh, you know too much or something. Because you were... I think she was the... The reporter was living at her inn, so yeah. There's a connection there. Alright. Then let's all work together and catch this asshole! Agreed. Chat, chat, chat. Yukiko joined a group. She'll definitely be the strongest asset. Uh, my cat is blocking my screen so I can't see it properly. She'll definitely be a strong asset in solving the case. Thou art I. I art thou. The investigation team social link has reached level 2. Your power to create personas of the full Karna has grown. But nice. how are we going to find them? We don't have a single lead yet. I'm the third one to be targeted so far, but I have a feeling this isn't the end of it. If we had an idea of who might be targeted next, wouldn't we have an advantage over the killer? So we'll outsmart them, huh? Yeah, that might work. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out what ties the victims together. First, there was that announcer, Mayumi Yamano. Second, was Saki Konishi, senpai. Third, was Yukiko Amagi. What do I they mean, all have in common? They were connected to the politician or something. They're all they all live in Inaba, they are all female. No. No, oh, the female thing is not it's not it. I don't think the guy likes killing females only. I think it's something like this. Bingo. Plus they're all women. How dare he target females? Now that's unforgivable. Culprit's gotta be some kind of pervert. Also, what about this? The second and third victims had some sort of connection to the first one. Hey, well, that's right! Yukiko and Saki Senpai both had connections to that announcer. Yeah, that's obvious. That's true. Then does that mean females connected in some way to Miss Yamano's case are being targeted? No, I think it's the next victim is gonna disprove that point about it only be fe being females and stuff. I think that's a safe assumption for now. There's yeah. another angle we can take too. If another person disappears... What? You think they'd be on that midnight channel? Yep. That happened right before Yukiko was kidnapped too! Yeah, it's hard to tell who at first, but what's important is, it's happened before the victims disappeared. Kinda like a ransom note. We still don't know why that happens, but we'll have to rely on it for now. The next time it rains. It seems that the Midnight Channel is o uh, your only means of predicting who will be kidnapped next. You must remember who to watch it on the uh, by next the way, night. aren't those done by now? Whoa, that's right! Chow time! <laughs> I love her vo voice actor. <laughs> it's so silly the way she says her lines. Hey, could I try just a little bit of that? Just one tiny bite? Seriously? Hands off the soba, pal. Go get your own if you want some. Okay. Just one bite. Got it? <laughs> Her voice actor is so... 
I don't know. I don't know the word for it, but she's so energetic and stuff. The delicious aroma from the udon ball is drifting your way. Oh, he's eating too much. Do you want to try some? Try a bite. Indirect kiss. <laughs> it's so good. The aroma, the flavor, and the texture all combined. This is perfect. Yusuke, relax. You're finishing it all. Oh, they're fr they're eating all of it. <laughs> ah, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> it's all gone. You Fried tofu. Oh, I'm so sorry, Yukiko. <laughs> it was so good. It was so good. I couldn't stop eating. I hope you guys understand what this means. Yeah, we'll pay you back. We'll pay you wait, back. Wait, 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 stop. I'm sorry. Wait, what? I'll buy you steak. It'll be on me. You hear me? The very best. That's right. Steak? Oh, no. My tofu. I'll buy you tofu. I'll buy you tofu. Why, Don't worry. Yukiko? There's steak in it for us now! We can eat instant noodles anytime we want, right? Well, as long as it isn't too fatty. Yeah, you gotta watch your weight. <laughs> I don't know why she's so... You know, self-conscious okay, about her weight. She looks so you good. You are hereby sentenced to buying a steak. What wouldn't be too fatty? Filet? Ooh, filet sounds nice and expensive. Filet, 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 filet mignon. <laughs> <laughs> the way she said that is so good. Hey, you've got a pony up too. You're just as much to blame. Yeah, I know. I understand. Man, talk about great timing. We just started serving grilled steak today. Oh, that looks so good. I remember eating that when in like Asian restaurants. Um... It doesn't have to be Filipino, it just has to be any Asian restaurant. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. That's just a yakisoba griddle. Oh well, steak is steak. Yeah. It's far from a filet steak, though. Uh -huh. Yukiko, are you okay with this? It's not too heavy for you? Come on. You guys should I'll appreciate what we're going. I'm uh, what, what we're giving you. You're still so mad? Yeah, I'm sorry. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. But Mizuzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Really? You know an awful lot about this. Okay, what about the second case? Saki-senpai. She found the announcer's body. Yep, she did. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target Senpai? It was a coincidence. It was to shut her up. They knew each other. It must be it. It must be it. They knew each Wait, other. you're saying Senpai and that Yamano lady knew each other? Maybe it was to keep her quiet? She could have noticed something that the culprit left at the scene. Exactly. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? I don't think he would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. Yeah, exactly. Or maybe she saw him, and that might be... Yeah, I thought the countryside would be a snooze, but it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, it's that guy who reveals too much. <laughs> oh, they updated the menu. Huh? Isn't he that detective? Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanako-chan? Aww. Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. So that means Dojima can't go to Jeunesse. I knew it. Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases, but we can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki-senpai in order to silence her? Um, you sure get to the heart of the matter. Yikes. Of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she... 
which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. You're revealing way too much again, Nadachi! Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Yep, we were. If Dojima was here, he would have hit you at the si uh, back side of your head. Uh, see ya! See ya. You were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. <laughs> ah! My steak's getting cold! Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? You waited for the two to finish eating, then decided to get into the TV world. Back again! Hello, Teddy! You thought we would abandon you? Nope. Where's Teddy? Wow! This really is inside the TV! Oh, there he is. It's Teddy! Then it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, I see. Good boy. Oh, well, this bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep. I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. The glasses. Nice. Oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. Very colorful. The... I don't know what they're called. The arms of the glasses are very colorful. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? Yeah, how do you make them so quickly? Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. Yeah, but with what? I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Are you wearing Listen contacts? To this. My eyes themselves are lenses. Uh-huh. You didn't know? Of course not. Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. <laughs> I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? The, what what, is he what doing? am I even looking at? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> hmm? You dropped something. Oh, that's a pair I kind of screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Yukiko? <laughs> How do I look? Looks great. <laughs> nice to see her being all cheerful after everything that's happened. Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. Oh, no you don't! How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Oh my god. His and his bear pun jokes. Guess I should have made an actual pair. Aw, too bad. Here, Chie, your turn. <sighs> Man. All right, fine. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> How'd it come to this? <laughs> Yukiko-san? Hello? There goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. I mean, what the hell's this nose for anyway? Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone and I get bored. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. Yep, it's glad to see. <laughs> oh, gee, I the look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. I can't stop <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. <laughs> we decided to go back for today. Oh, that was it? I thought there, was, there would be more or something. Oh, well. The fourth and the fifth. What's I that? think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Really? 
Really? Really? <laughs> what, you don't believe me? It's always cancelled. Yep, it always is. Not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a... Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! Yay! We're going on a trip on our favorite mm. rocket ship. All right. All right. Then we need to think of some place to go. How about you? You want to come along with us? I want to come? Sure. Yeah, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. You'll be, hang you'll be going on an outing with the Dojimas during the long holiday. Let's bring back lunches. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. So you're gonna leave the chore to me. Okay, hmm. I see. Well, it'll work out. That's what we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? Oh, god damn it. Yay! Box lunches! Nanako is pleased you've been selected to pack the family's box lunches. Lunchish. Why did I say lunchish? <laughs> vacation, vacation, I can't wait. You asked Nanako for permission. Tomorrow's a rate. No, tomorrow's uh, overcast, so okay. Where's Mr. Dojima? A vacation, huh? Should we make reservations now? To what? A hotel? Or a restaurant? I think catches your eye. Well, I think that's it for this episode of Persona 4 Golden. Until next time, we'll see what's next. We'll see who will appear in the Midnight Channel next and what the killer is up to. But for now, we're gonna leave it here and I'm gonna take a bit of a rest. Sorry I haven't been uploading consistently because sometimes I, there's some stuff I have to work on. But I'll make some videos beforehand then upload them like consistently from now on. So until then, I'll see you guys later. Once again, this is Alex, Ali, Jeff, all eights. I hope you guys have a good evening, a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.